Welcome back everyone to episode 8 of my hardcore Iron Man series. We are starting this episode off with completing the giant dwarf quest. Now I don't really have a plan for this video. I don't really know what I'm going to do, but I believe I'm going to start off by just training my magic up a little bit. I bought a bunch of chaos runes a couple days ago, and uh, I just kind of want to use those up, get my magic a little bit higher, and um, along the way we're going to collect dragon bones because we're going to be killing dragons and we will hopefully get our prayer up a bit higher. So yeah, look what we have here, a hard clue scroll. I guess we're gonna go and do that, I guess. I'm just gonna pick up everything here because why not? Okay, so I just quickly looked up what the hell this Baker climb meant, and now I would have to complete the troll quest line to get to Trollweiss Mountain. I don't even know what that means. So. I'm just gonna drop this because I don't really feel like doing quests right now. I think it okay, it just completely stopped me from dropping it, but yeah, we're not we're not completing that and thank you for stealing my spot. And a few kills later we have another one. Let's see if this is possible. Talk to Sir Ah, that's possible! Let's go do that. Oh, and we got the casket! I am getting out of here as fast as I can go! Oh, we are out! I had to get my uh, my main to escort me there because I was just way too scared. But uh, yeah, now we have this. Let's see what we get. Ooh, that'll look really cool. I also got a magic shortbow. I believe that's for like a quest or something. I don't know. I, say, I see a bunch of people complaining that they need to get a higher fletching level for it, but that's, that is a very nice clue scroll. I like that. Let's equip this. Oh, this is actually amazing to get because they're freaking rare. And we did it. Yes! Oh, yes! We did it! Where, where are we? Where are we? Where? Huh? I think I'm supposed to step into this pool now, so let's go into here. Step into the sparkling pool. Yes, here we are! We're finally getting the cape. I was really scared to get it, but, uh, well, here we are. I think I'm gonna have to go with Zamorok. There's our nice cape. Let's take like freaking seven of them. We took three. Ah, oh, that looks so nice. So I am currently in the process of making a Google Doc to organize what I will be doing in the next few weeks. Now I have been working on getting Bones to Peaches as you could probably tell by the progress hat in my inventory, but that's probably not the only thing I'll be getting there. I'm also going for the boots. Now the boots don't really cost too much, so that's why I'll be getting them. I already have the telekinetic points, and um, I'm a quarter of the way to getting the alchemist points, and then zero the other ones, but uh, yeah. Now sometime in the future I would like to quickly get 99 fire making out of the way. This is just for the goodies, and also the chant at the tome. I've said before that if I don't get the tome within the time of getting 99, I'll just continue onward and go until I get it, but I don't think I'll be doing that anymore. If I don't get the tome, I'll just go for the mage's book instead, since it's like two times better, but I mean, it's also a pain to get. So in the meantime of getting bones to peaches, I'm going to be doing some farming on the side, because this these oak trees will take a day to grow, and like, you know, I might as well not waste any time with farming, because it's only 17 that I have, which is terrible. But with all these oak trees, I should be getting quite a high level. Now I just realized that in order to get the rest of my alchemist points for the book and, or not the book, the boots and the bows to peaches, I'm going to need a lot more nature runes. So I think I'm just going to go and blow my stack on freaking nature runes. I have hopped for freaking ages now and every single magic store has like them all sold out. Like these are way too much. I'm not spending money for that. You can usually buy them for I think like 160 and that is 215. That's way too much. So. I think I'm just going to be getting 35 rune crafting. I'm going to do what lies below. Now after I complete what lies below, I'll still be required to rune craft around 3000 cosmic runes to get me to 44, which is the required level for nature runes. All right, sick. We have completed what lies below, which puts our rune crafting at 38, which is <laughs> very 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 nice. So we just need to craft our 3000 cosmic runes. And then we can craft our own nature runes, which is going to be beautiful. All right, so I have spent the last few hours just collecting pure essence so that we now have our 3,000 goal. 
What I'm going to be doing next is crafting my cosmic rune so that I can get my rune crafting to, of course, 44. And then I might end this video there because I want to get this video up before tonight. In the meantime, after completing our pure essence grind, our oak trees are now grown. So let's get that experience level 19 right off the start. We can now grow Terramin, which is pretty nice. And just from those few minutes right there, we have gotten from 18 farming to 22. All right, so it is the next day now. And I said that I wanted to get this video up last night, but I did not do anything last night. So right now I just achieved 43 rune crafting and we have like around 4,000 cosmics in the bank. So yeah, I have 4,012 cosmic runes in the bank and 880 pure essence left, which I will be doing over the weekend just so I can get that. Um, one last look at the stats, got 43 rune crafting, uh, 1,063 total level, about to hit 10 million total experience, which is pretty cool. Thank you for all the comments on my last video, I really liked reading those, and, uh, thank you for the support, and, uh, yeah, I just like to say that I would like to change my name from HC Ceradomen, because HC Ceradomen is freaking terrible, but I don't know what to change it to. If you guys have suggestions, I guess you can just leave a comment and... You know, I, I don't know if there's any, and I'll pick through them and see what's up. So yeah, please leave a like, please subscribe, and I will see you guys in a few days. Goodbye.